guys today we will be talking about different circuit components that what are the circuit components so circuit components are basically those element are basic of a circuit or fundamental of a circuit so what do we mean by the fundamental of a circuit fundamental of a circuit are basically those component or element which are the basic or raw material for a circuit so this is basically fundamental of a circuit. So we have placed resistance, resistors at the, at the top of our list that we are going to discuss. So what is resistors? Resistors are basically those electrical components which offer resistances to the flow of charges when we place in the path of current flow. So it means that if we placed resistors in the path of current, it basically limit the flow of current which means that the current will be reduced in that path so this is basically the main function or the fundamental function of a resistor however resistor have got different values that can be guessed from its color bands that a resistor may have four color band five, five color band and six color band even so these are basically the method to find out the resistances uh, the resistance value of a resistor so next we have capacitors. Basically, capacitor is two terminal electrical device. Uh, however, it is not restricted to two terminal. It may have six terminal, but the one we are going to discuss have two terminal. Two terminal it have two plates which stores electrical charges in the form of electric field. Or simply we can see that it store electrical energy in the form of electric field. So a capacitor can also be used. For starting purposes, like uh, if we have a fan, if we want to start it, then we introduce for there a capacitor. For what purposes? For ignition purposes. It can be used for several other purposes. Uh, next, we have got thermistors. So, what is thermistor? Thermistors are basically a temperature sensor whose resistance varies when temperature changes. Like if we are making some changes in the environment of a thermistor, then their resistance varies with the changes in the in temperature. Then we are going to discuss what are the types of thermistors. There are basically two types of thermistors. So the thermistor first is NTC and the second is PTC. What about NTC? NTC basically stands for negative temperature coefficient. So what is the negative temperature coefficient? Negative temperature coefficient thermistors are those thermist thermistors whose resistances goes on decreasing when we increase the temperature of its environment. Or you can simply say that when we reduce the temperature of its environment, then the resistance goes on increasing. Next we have got PTC. So PTC is basically positive temperature coefficient. So positive temperature coefficient simply implies that if we increase the temperature of a thermistor then their internal resistance is also increases so this was all about the temperature uh, sensor that is basically thermistors so next we have an inductor what is an inductor inductor basically two terminal electrical device they usually don't allow allow the current to make changes like it maintain the uh, constant level of a current. It do not allow any kind of changes in current level. Like uh, it has store electrical energy in the form of magnetic field. So this was all about uh, an inductor. Hope uh, you have completely understood this uh, circuit element and circuit component and their function. So thank you so much.